Hey guys, welcome back to our channel. Today I've got Abby here with me, my daughter, and we're gonna make a really fun craft. It's this fun snow globe, and I have a picture of our family. We're actually jumping in the photo, and then it's got water and glitter inside, so when you mix it up, you'll let some of that kind of fall down in there. And you kind of mix it up a little bit, it turns into a fun snow globe. So I put some rose gold glitter in there, but you can choose any color of glitter. We actually have put it up on our fireplace, and I'll show you that, because then the lights behind the glitter and the water, it really like brings out a lot of the fun in the jar. So that's what we're gonna make today. We've also made some for our cousins who are coming over for a Christmas party today. So what we're gonna do is we're going to take photos. I've done the photos of my kids and the tall ones work the best, but like you can see here, we have a really wide one and a short one, so they work as well. You just need to make sure it fits in your jar. So I've taken a photo and cut out the image of the person and then I've laminated each one of them all the way around so that the photo stays okay inside the water and also so that it stands up nice and rigid. So then what we're gonna do, we're gonna take our lid and we're gonna put a band of hot glue right across that lid and then we're gonna kind of push that lamination and the pitcher down into that and it kind of melts the bottom of the lamination and helps it to really stick well to the lid and then you can add any kind of decoration to it we're going to add probably some white trees in front but you could add anything we actually have one here he actually has like he's a harry potter in this picture which is really cute he's got his wand and he's pointing it out and so i put a little potion jar next to the tree just to kind of go along with the theme of his Harry Potter. So you can do anything you want. You just want to make sure that whatever you're putting in the jar is water resistant. So that's what we're going to do. I'll show you how we do it. So Abby, you want to hold that lid. We're going to hold it down on the counter. I'm going to take my glue. You want to go quick. It doesn't take two people, but it helps. So that I can get the glue on there really good. There you go. And then you want to like so what she's doing, she's really pushing down on it. And then we have to just sit here and hold it until it dries. Okay, so there you go. It's nice and rigid, stuck on there. Then we're gonna take, I think we'll do a white tree. So then we're just gonna hot glue bottom of the tree. Let's stick that on there to make sure it's not gonna be in the way of the jar. So now we're gonna take this one again and just double check that it fits fine and it doesn't hit the edges of the jar. You wanna just make sure that the threading isn't gonna get in the way at all right here because you need to make sure you have a good seal on the outside. And then also you wanna place it so that you have, you know how you have the, the writing on the jar? You don't want that writing to be covering up their face or the picture or whatever you put in there. So I just need to make sure that that's placed in the right spot. Okay, so we're gonna do our other two really quick. They're gonna be a little bit different. So we're gonna do three little trees on one and then another one tree on the other. Okay, ready, go. Okay, I'm gonna work on this one. You ready? Yep. I can hold it. Might need to push it down a bit. Yeah. So if you push it down, the lamination kind of melts into the glue and it helps. You can also take your glue gun and add a little thin layer above where you just put some down to kind of secure it in the front and the back. So I'm gonna let these two dry. So now for the fun part, right Abby? Mm -hmm. We're gonna fill it with water. Water first or glitter first? Glitter what do you think? First. She likes doing the glitter. Okay, go ahead. We're gonna do our rose gold glitter for ours. When our cousins come over today, they're gonna pick their own color of glitter. Is that a good one more? You put more in than you think. Okay, that's probably good. Okay, you wanna add it to the other jars too? Okay. 
And I'm gonna add water. And see, I think you need more glitter. You wanna fill it as full as you can so that when you tip it, you don't have too much of a gap at the top. Yeah, we need to add more glitter there. Okay, we'll get more water. Okay, so we're gonna work on these two right here. Got our little guy here, our little girl, I should say. And I wanna line up, I've got the words to the jar on the back here, so it's blank on the front. So I really wanna line this up perfectly. Scoot that into the, oh, see it took all the, it took all the glitter. So now we're gonna put our lid on. You can decorate this if you want to. It's upside down, so you don't need to worry about what the bottom looks like, but you could paint this or add ribbons. Could I shake it? Yeah, you wanna shake it? Could add any kind of pictures. We're actually gonna keep these ones up probably all year, just because I didn't make them too Christmassy. So anyway, I hope you like that, you guys. I'll kind of show you these displayed on our mantle with lights behind it, so you can kind of see what they look like. But thank you for watching. Subscribe to our channel and come back for more. Thanks, bye.